let's talk business cards. So I think business cards are very important. Uh, I don't think you have to have a tiny t-shirt as a business card. It's a little bit different when you put yourself out there every day and people may have a good chance of uh, knowing your name by your URL. So that's why I did the t-shirt. But business cards, I picked up a lot of them lately. I've been traveling, I've been to conferences, I've been speaking, and I get a lot of business cards, I hand a lot of them out, and you can see that everyone's business cards are completely different. Uh, you know, some are white, some are pictures, some have a lot of information, some have very little information. I think the key to a good business card is keeping it very, very simple. Put the information, your bare bones information of what you need for people to get in touch with you. A phone number, an email address, your name, uh, always important to put your name on there. But I think a lot of people try and cram so much information. Like I talk about with first impressions, business cards are your chance at a lasting impression. So when people go back to their offices and they're going through all these business cards, what's going to set yours out from this pile? Now that doesn't mean it has to be big or weird or a pop-up or anything crazy, but if they, if they leave through it and it looks kind of unprofessional and they say, oh, well, you know, ugh, that business card, I wasn't really sure about that person, their business card's really ugly. I'm just saying, these are impressions that people can get from business cards. Keep it very simple. Uh, you know, I would say information on the front, something on the back. Maybe it's a quote from Albert Einstein. Maybe it's a funny picture of your dog if your business allows it. Do something that is a lasting impression that someone will remember when they see your business card and just keep it simple. One font, maybe one or two colors, keep it very easy to read and remember. So that's my, uh, my little tidbit on business cards. Now I gotta go email all these people and say hello, which you should do anytime you get business cards.